Hello everyone, in this video we will understand what is workflow data fabric. So this terminology was introduced in ServiceNow recently and I will explain you what is workflow data fabric and why do we need it and how does it make sense with agentic AI. So let's quickly jump into the video. To explain this, I will break down each and every term of workflow data fabric. So I will explain what is workflow, then data and then fabric. First of all, what is workflow? A workflow is a step by step process that tells how something should be done. Example, you report an issue that your laptop is not working on the incident form. The service just gets notified and then the respective desktop team works on it, they fix it, the ticket is resolved, you get a notification and then eventually the ticket is closed. So this is all a workflow. Next is what is data? Data is information like your name, your issue, the time you reported and how your issue was fixed. All of it is data. Next is what is fabric? If we look under the microscope of fabric, there are many threads stitched together. Similarly, in technology, fabric means how information from different systems are connected in a smart, seamless way. In other words, we are bringing the data from different places like ServiceNow, Salesforce, Oracle databases, MongoDBs, Wherever we have that data, we bring it together. Now, uh, I'll take you to these definitions. These are present on ServiceNow documentation. First of all, the left side, workflow data fabric unifies data across enterprises to supercharge automation. It connects your systems like Salesforce, SAP, Snowflake, etc. To make more sense of this definition, it will bring all the data from different departments, different tools, different platforms and make it usable, consistent and trustworthy. It will understand actually all the data from different places. And remember that ServiceNow is not storing data in ServiceNow. It will just go and understand data from different departments or different platforms like Salesforce, SAP or Snowflake. So ServiceNow is not a database tool. It's a platform which will go and understand data from different places. Now, when it understands data from different places, what it will do? Workflow data fabric is really describing how ServiceNow agents weave data together from different workflows and departments to create a digital fabric or you can say a digital workflow. ServiceNow AI agents are going to different tools, understand their data, understand their workflow and then come back to ServiceNow agentic AI and ServiceNow AI agents will make the decisions or create the workflows accordingly what they have understood from different places. So this is a picture which I got from ServiceNow documentation again. Here, if you see on the first column, workflow data fabric will connect your data. So it could be through your spokes or we can stream the data or ServiceNow introduced zero copy data partners. What that means is ServiceNow has zero copy connectors with Databricks, Snowflake and a few other tools and ServiceNow is now coming up with more and more connectors also. So what is zero copy data connector? In this, you set up an integration with a third party tool like Snowflake and it will go and read the data, understand the data, but it will not copy the data into ServiceNow. Hence the name is zero copy data partners or zero copy data connectors. After you have connected your data, ServiceNow will understand that data. And once ServiceNow has understood that data, it has made sense out of that, it will act on your data. So AI agents will be creating workflows according to what they have understood. I hope you were able to understand what is workflow data fabric. 
If you still have any questions, please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching the video.